The adult bee disease, Nesema, is a major economic cause of loss for the beekeeping industry. Um, however, it's one of the diseases beekeepers can actually do the monitoring for themselves. All they need is a microscope with a 300 power um, amplification. They need a counting chamber, or this is called a hemocytometer. So that's where we put the uh, slurry that we made up, make up from the bees onto the, uh, onto the microscope. We need just some water, some bees, which I collected previously from a hive, and just a measuring device so we can measure out 10 mils of water, and also a mortar and pestle so we can grind the bees up into a paste with the water to put onto the counting chamber, which we then observe under the microscope. For this test, we require the abdomen of 10 bees. It is a gut disease for the bees, so we only need the back end of the bees. So we use scissors just to snip the abdomen off. So we remove 10, 10 of those. There's one. So now I've got the 10 abdomens in there in the mortar and pestle. I need to add 10 mils of water to that as well. So I'll just suck that up and place that in there. And so now we've added the water, we've got the bee abdomen, so it's just a matter of grinding those bees up. So the recipe for it is per one abdomen, it's one mill of water. Um, so once that's well and truly ground up into a good mix, we need a cover slip over our counting chamber placed on there and then we need to apply um, I suppose this counting chamber has grooves down the side so it doesn't have excess amount of liquid on there there's a measured amount of volume over each of the counting uh, I suppose they're uh, scribes in the glass which allow you to have a set measurement and set volume within and under that um, cover slip so it's just a matter of putting some of this syrup from your slurry Onto the slide, I can use a range of different things. It feeds in under the uh, cover, cover slide just through capillary action. So then it's a matter of just looking at it under the microscope, finding the focal point, and then counting the number of spores within a set uh, area.